All right, so I just got something funny to show you. Yeah. So this was on The Mentalist, and this is, uh, we're watching it on uh, Amazon Prime. I don't know if it's part of one of my other packages or Amazon Prime. And so I don't know if you'll see this on closed captioning everywhere, but I'm gonna go ahead and go back a little bit. Uh, this is uh, season five, episode 15, Red Lacquer Nail Polish. So the scene is this woman was murdered and they found nothing but ash on the floor. So that's the, the plot and they found it, you know, because they thought spontaneous combustion, it wasn't. Anyway, she's murdered. Um, they're going back to the crime scene. They're looking at all her pictures and stuff of parties she, of parties she threw and things she was involved with because she was very, very wealthy. And, and so they don't really say it in the scene, but it was like the things they were saying was of acknowledgement, like too bad this happened to her. Uh, you got that vibe, like too bad this happened to her. She did this stuff. Um, and uh, etc. But like I say, it wasn't really the words or the dialogue, it was just the vibe they were trying to portray of, of like as they're discussing this old woman that had died, let's feel sorry for her. And so it looks like somebody sabotaged closed captioning because there's a moment of silence and then these words get injected and I looked at my daughter and I go, why is it still doing closed captioning when no one's saying anything? Because it was like about a full minute of no speaking while they're just looking at the pictures. Nobody's saying a word. And at first I thought maybe the closed captioning was just out of time and was playing something to be said further on in dialogue in the show. It wasn't. During that minute, somebody added their thoughts and their opinion to the scene. Let's check it out. 22 minutes and 21 seconds in. So this is the scene, I'm gonna just put my camera on it and the closed captioning is up and just to make sure you don't miss it, I'm gonna go ahead and read the closed captioning when they get done talking, but this will paint the picture here. Uh, somebody was having fun. I wonder how often this happens. She may have been America's tragic heiress, but she sure knew how to throw a party. Look at these photos. Hot and cold running service, fine food, champagne, and wine. Some people get to have it all, but that wasn't enough, was it? People are supposed to feel sorry for her, too. Poor people get orphaned. Poor people get divorced. Nobody cares. But what right does she have to get it all when most people don't get none? What? Take a look at this. So yeah, that was my first experience seeing sabotaged closed captioning. <laughs> uh, I'm curious now. I, I don't know why closed captioning was on. It started. It it got stuck on the other day, and I haven't had a chance to go through and figure out how to turn it off on the Roku. Um, but uh, that was interesting. 